words now. Alrighty, what am I going to be able to do here? I got to try to figure out how to drill a hole in it. <laughs> I don't know, let me edit what out of my video. <laughs> no. Okay, since I can't take Billy Burt anywhere without his potty mouth. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> All right, so I, I didn't do a whole lot of talking because I wasn't quite sure what I was doing. I ground a, a flat spot on this off camera because uh, I was a little worried that it might be grabby in that so uh, I'm just gonna put some five minute epoxy down in here and I left grooves in it so they had somewhere to go and we'll put it up in here and leave it set overnight and I'll give her a try and see how she works tomorrow uh, <laughs> I mean I guess uh, and then, then I'll, I'll drag it over there and I'll try to explain what I did if I can remember what I did okay now that I changed the volume level on the chipmunks over there you can yell all you want Billy Burt they can't hear you now. <laughs> All right, so I guess really just the plan is I'm gonna put some in the hole and wipe some on there and hopefully I got enough. If not, I guess I'll mix up some more and do it again another time, but. The idea was to put those rails in there so that the glue had somewhere to go and that also had something to hold onto once it was in there. We'll see here in a second, won't we? Probably. 
it probably just jump all out of there and stuff. So, all right, so I filled that up and the plan was to just kind of squish it in here. I don't know, I may not have made it, oh, maybe. I think somewhere in that general direction, like so. All right, so, uh, yeah, no, my handle's a little crooked. I'm not perfect. I think like that is what I like. And, and hopefully it serves its purpose. I mean, it's a homemade tool. What do you want? <laughs> um, I'm a little nervous about this because it is kind of grabby in there. But... Okay, well, uh, I may take this off. Uh, I just left it there so I could probably, you know, try and do some hollow forms or something. But it, it is a bit grabby, even with this on here. Maybe this just isn't flat enough or whatever. But uh, uh, for the most part, it's doing what I wanted it to do in there, which was hollow around the and down in there. Uh, I don't, even if I take it off, I got way more than enough handle, I think, or way more than enough of that anyways. But I think that it, it, unless I get used to it, this may come off and it might just be a straight one. But for right now, it's doing what I wanted and it doesn't look too bad in there. So, you know, everybody over here to the, to the sticker board and <coughs> I guess talk to it. <laughs> so a couple things before we get to this. Uh, Ken Moon is doing a big giveaway over at Moon Pie Creations. So I will put the link to where he talks about it, whatever you need to be doing to enter that. I will put that over there. <clears throat> and then I got um, a sticker from uh, Yusuf over at Noon, Nooncraft. So uh, thanks for a sticker, Yusuf. Uh, I gotta get one, I believe I gotta get one back to you. I haven't done it yet, but it's, it's on its way. Uh, I'll also put his link over there into the corner for his YouTube channel. He's got some videos up. He actually does some pretty nice stuff. He does some cutting boards uh, where he lays them out and does it. So, uh, um, yeah, go check him out and go over and check out Ken, his giveaway. Uh, he's giving away, you know, the Total Boat Star Bond uh, axe and maybe some other stuff. I, I'm, I'm not qualified because I'm sponsored by three of those. You guys do giveaways and I can't enter them. <laughs> so no go over and check out Ken's go see what you need to do because I believe you got to go over and comment on the video he's actually doing a giveaway in but he's telling you about it so I'm just gonna put that one over there you follow that and do what he tells you to do in that one anyways we have yeah, this the, the, oh, I can't go any further that now I think it's a bit grabby unless I get used to it it's a bit chattery out there with that much on the end. I did uh, drill and tap that. That is a four millimeter seven. I think it's seven. Uh, it, it's metric. It confuses me. But I stole the screw out of this, the Nigs of Medi tools I have. <laughs> and I need to go get I need to go get a replacement for it. But that's the one I used. So I'm going to go get a replacement for it. Uh, this piece here is actually um, a broken piece off one of the riding lawn tractors. Uh, that, that actually controls your steering back and forth so it goes from one side to the other and that's what the little hind joint balls were but the one the one had popped out so I figured hey there's a 5 8 bar I can use uh, my handle is just a piece of poplar um, I had laying around it's an inch and a half poplar it was I don't know 16 or 17 inches and then right there I bought a one inch brass or copper it's copper one inch copper <laughs> cap and I drilled a hole in it. So 5 eighths hole down the center, super glued in. Now I didn't talk about it because I didn't really know what I was doing or how it was gonna turn out. And like I said, that may or may not stay. The the, the vibrations which you've seen, I, just, I was just testing it out on that. Um, it does work, don't get me wrong. Uh, it, it Maybe I don't have enough flat on this because I just, I just kinda, 
I didn't, <laughs> there was no precision to this. I just laid it down and cut that with a grinder uh, as best as I could, eyeballed it, you know. If, you know, Brad over there, give me a hard time about it, Brad, Brad's workbench. Uh, no, I did eyeball that. I cut it with a grinder and I didn't film it. I did it after the fact. I was expecting this video to be way longer than I ended up with. So that, that's what I got. So I'm going to lay it down in here somewhere and take some pictures of it or a picture of it or I got some other pictures I might put up. But I'll put that at the end. I'll put links to everybody else at the end also so you can just click on them. So Noon Crafts, Yusuf, you can go over and check him out and go over and check out Candy Moon Pie Creations. <laughs> and, you know, give her a thumbs up or give her a thumbs down. This actually wasn't that bad, but now I, I got the fabricating background, so I was a welder most of my life. So <laughs> the, the fabricating wasn't a real big deal for me, and I have the tools to do so. Uh, most of them are really old or broken, but I do have them. Hey, it works, and like this was already hollowed. I'm going to try it again on a different one and see how well it goes, but uh, maybe this Friday's project. We'll see. We'll see. But anyways, um, yeah, we'll see you all later.